today's Casa calendar update where we let you know what's going on. And today we're talking about All Is Calm, the Christmas Truce of 1914, playing at the Vortex Theater. During World War I, soldiers on the Western Front did not expect to celebrate on the battlefield, but even a world war could not destroy the Christmas spirit. It is Christmas Eve 1914, and joining me now to talk about this play are two stars, Mark Comstock and William R. Stafford. Thank you so much for coming in, guys. Thanks now, I pride myself on knowing about Christmas. I know the songs, I know the stories, but this is one that I personally have not really heard about. Now, why, why is that? Why didn't we learn about this like in school? Well, I think a big part of it is just because it's World War I. It just seems so so distant mm -hmm. um, to us. But, um, you know, they still celebrate that. And um, it's one of those things that when that story came about, Mother Road and Vortex got together and thought it needed to be told. All right. Now, why did you choose this piece? Well, we chose this piece, you know, ultimately because of the message of peace and because of the songs. And like you said about the, the Christmas songs. Now, mm -hmm. what's really very intriguing about this piece is that it's in 1914 when the World War started, uh, America wasn't in this war. So all of these songs are what, the, what they knew in those countries. Um, okay. We sing in German, we sing in French. Uh, Is that more difficult? It's very difficult Okay. for those of us that don't speak those languages. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, right. like, yeah. well, I'm assuming. Yeah. Now, you guys were telling me this is all a cappella. How, how different is that? And is it, it it's got to be more difficult, right? Yeah, definitely it's a challenge. You know, we kind of start out with a, a note backstage, and then once we're on it, we're on there for an hour straight. Mm -hmm. And um, luckily we've got people who've got some really good pitch. Right. And we kind of just <laughs> find our footing and go from there. Now, how well, many people are part of this? There's 13 guys on stage singing a cappella, all of these songs. And, okay. um, and then at the end, there, there's a surprise at the end as well. Okay. Um, yeah, but, it, you know, one of the things that intrigues me the most about this is the message of peace. Mm -hmm that the lowest of the ranks for one night in, two, in 1914 stopped the war, or at least the war there, and sang, yeah. and just got together and sang. And so the message of peace, it's very, very powerful. It's very emotional. Mm -hmm. I lose it every night. Yeah. You know, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm bawling you know, every night. And, and it's just part of the, it's the nature of it. And it's kind of, I mean, it's, it's good timing considering, you know, what's kind of going on in, in the world right, right now, and people can connect with that, I mean, because that's why we learn about history, because, right. you know, we learn how to get through these things. Right. Now, who, who do you think should go see this? Is it everybody? Is it a date night? Can we bring our kids? You know, I think the, the message of peace that we're talking about is a, is a universal thing. Mm -hmm. um, we've had kids come to it and respond, because there's also interesting uh, monologues from soldiers at the time talking about their experience intermixed with the music. Okay. Um, yeah, I think uh, 12 and up, easy. Yeah, easy. Okay. Uh, you know, my nine-year-old daughter came and loved it. Okay. And had lots of questions about World War One and and how it affected her, uh, but the monologues and the memoirs are very interesting because it is, it's all true. It's all based on true memoirs. Okay. So some of the things that we're saying and all of the songs that we're singing. So yeah, I, I, I would recommend it for everybody, families in particular. Yeah. Okay. Now you guys have guest buglers on the show. Tell us a little about that. Yeah, we have a final repose at the end of the show, and we have two buglers who uh, alternate and do that for us. And. Um, if you're not already emotional going into that show, that moment will be the uh, icing it, it, on the yeah, cake. Yeah, it, it takes it, you there. Yeah, okay, that's where everybody yeah. loses it. Yeah, and okay. uh, they're, they're spectacular. Okay, now tell me about the collaboration between Mother Road and the Vortex. Well, Mother Road and the Vortex, Mother Road Theater for the last eight seasons hasn't really had a permanent home. Okay. And so this, this holiday season, it was a, it was a great relationship mm -hmm. to, to hook up with the Vortex. Mm -hmm. So we're using the Vortex space. It's a co-production, and um, it's been wonderful. You know, from a Mother Road perspective, to have that that holiday season there, it's a great space. I don't know, you know, if you know the old Langells building, mm -hmm. the Vortex has been in there for for several years now, right. Right. and it's just a really nice space. It's very intimate. There's about a hundred seats, That's so cool. it, it's so right you there feel in like your you're face. Right there in it. Yeah. Yeah. You can really yeah. get it feels really good, okay. uh, and particularly with that a cappella sound. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and there's there's no instruments other than the bugle at the end, mm -hmm. so it's just voices. Yeah. And that alone is, is very, very emotional, very touching, yeah. and it's just that sound. It's the, the straight no chaser kind of yeah. feel. <laughs> it's just, yeah, it's really cool. Absolutely. Yeah. Now, all right, if somebody wants to go see it, when, where, how? Yeah, we run through the 27th at uh, the Vortex Base, which is 2900 Carlisle. Okay. And you can get uh, tickets at vortexabq.org. Okay. 
and uh, we run this Thursday through Sunday, next Thursday through Sunday, and then we do Christmas through the 27th. So we have a 6 o'clock Christmas Day oh, show. Great. So this would be perfect. Instead of going to the movie theater like a lot of people do on Christmas, That's go right. see this show. Go see yeah, the show. Right. And, and yeah, and, and what's cool about this show, too, is it, it's like going to a concert. It's, it's 58 minutes. Mm -hmm. It's one hour okay. of just music, in your yeah, face right. music. And, and it's really very touching and emotional. Like it. All right. Well, if you guys want a link to their website so you can get tickets, just head over to Casa.com. And if you have an event that you want to submit, just head to Casa.com, click on the local events tab, and then click submit.